I'm going to do something a little bit different this morning. First, I'm wearing something different here. I'm wearing my Korean cap. I wore this cap in Korea, and the story is going to be centered on Korea, so what better thing to wear than that? What I'm going to talk about is Lipton noodle soup. Uh, it was one of the treats that we had over there, especially in the winter. Uh, my mother would write me a letter every week, and it would come in and it'd have a little packet of Lipton chicken flavored noodle soup in it. And it could come for just one stamp, and uh, it didn't take it over the limit. And what I do is, uh, we lived in tents in Korea. And in the winter time, it would snow and it was cold. And we did have heat there. We had a pot-bellied stove that operated on a diesel barrels set outside the uh, tent and hooked up with a hose. And and it gave some. It's kind of like the old-fashioned pot-bellied stove. You'd be warm on one side and cold on the other. And our tent was 16 foot square, four people stayed in it, and if you want to compare it, that'd be a fairly large bedroom or a small living room. And we slept in there on our cots. And uh, slept in uh, sleeping bags. We had what they called an Arctic sleeping bag, which is supposed to be good down to uh, uh, 20 degrees, and it did a pretty good job down to that. But the uh, guys up north, up uh, toward the Yalu River, fighting the Chinese, it got to 20 below up there quite often. And actually, we lost more people from freezing to death in their tents than we did from gunfire. More of the more of the men died in Korea from freezing than they, than from actual war. But anyway, what we do is, uh, or what I do, is I take my canteen cup, fill it about half full of water, set it on this uh, pot-bellied stove, and as soon as it got hot, I would take one of those packets of soup mix, pour it in there, stir it in, and let it uh, simmer for a little bit. And man, I'll tell you what, on a cold winter night, there is nothing better than uh, that cold, that hot noodle soup, and uh, I, I went ahead and made some here that uh, on the stove. I didn't figure there was anything, any thrill watching soup boil, so I didn't even videotape that. But uh, I've got it here, and I'll show it to you. Okay, now the thing about these canteen cups, they do get hot, and so the handles of them get hot, they're all aluminum and everything, and this is a little hot, so uh, I'm going to have to be careful with it. Even today is delicious. This had time to cool a little and it's really it's drinkable now. Got some noodles in there, little, little, little noodles. And I'm going to have this more often now that winter's coming on instead of hot chocolate or uh, hot cocoa or something like that in the evenings. Uh, I've just forgotten how good this really was. So I'm going to finish my soup. <clears throat> God bless America. God bless Texas. 
And where would else would you find a sign like this other than in Texas? You folks have a great day. Bye.